hey guys hope you are doing well so after the yesterday correction the market is consolidating prices are uh, coming back a little bit so let's get into my name is Mike Dankler from Corimnex and I'm bringing you the most important crypto news technical analysis altcoin NFT DeFi gems every day to keep you updated and educated I should state that nothing in this video can be considered as a financial or investment advice everything just for your education and entertainment purposes only guys smash those like push the bell and notification or subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so smashing those like helping out the YouTube algorithm so let's go and check our uh, favorite bubble chart let's see what's happening out there we see Bitcoin is up almost 2% Ethereum is up 1.5% and we see most of the altcoins are correcting just few of them like XCN and Remix is uh, correcting but XCN uh, rallied in the past months is up 100% in a month and uh, we see other altcoins are uh, just uh, uh, in green ADA is after the correction is also coming back ICP uh, did a nice run up Chili's Ape STX Holochain and Loopring Mana doing well let's go and check out our favorite indicator the crypto fear and greed index it is at 13 so after this uh, bullish and uh, bullishness uh, the small uh, two days bullishness and the index uh, dipped back uh, to these lower uh, 10 uh, levels and is still in the extreme fear zone as you see it's flooding out so not too much happening here and also we can look into on the look into bitcoin.com at the fear and greed index and we see uh, in a heat map or a heat chart that's showing when we are green that uh, we are in uh, the greedy uh, zone and when we are in red uh, like uh, now at uh, around 10 we are in the extreme fear zone so this is a good indicator so 13 out of 100 so the sentiment the market sentiment still is bearish let's go to our first news over 500 million us dollar liquidated as bitcoin drops back under 30,000 us dollars so that was yesterday and uh, majority of liquidations 350 million first occurred on bitcoin trades with relatively smaller amounts cleared from altcoins so the majority is from bitcoin cool and this is the liquidation event that happened yesterday so uh, that was the uh, bitcoin uh, chart and showing this cascade to the downside and also uh, with spiking volume and that caused the liquidation and pushed the bitcoin price back uh, below 30,000. but now we are about a little bit next piece of news is here is a realistic price pass for bitcoin over the next six months according to crypto analyst and this is kaleo with his half a million twitter followers and uh, he believes that btc support of around 28,000 will continue to hold until september before bitcoin takes it out and plummets all the way below 20,000 us dollar i am a simple man with simple dreams basically still expect something like this to play out over the next six months six to nine months so he expects that bitcoin can bounce uh, up to 35,000 us dollar or maybe 40 and then uh, just side waving and dropping uh, to the 20,000 us dollar so this is what he sees for so probably won't be quite as vertical as what the blue lines above show or the arrow below, below but I don't expect it to be way too off again not playing this move for a reversal leading to a new bull market playing this as a bullish swing within a range okay so he still expect that uh, it, uh, it can bounce up to 37,000 US dollar first level to watch is a retest of the lower high time frame diagonal resistance which should be around 36,000 US dollar I expect a bit of resistance there and I'm hoping for a squeeze to the higher diagonal resistance in the high 30s low 40s basically 
er erasing the bearish Luna price action for now. So that would erasing the bearish Luna price action now. But uh, then he expects that Bitcoin can drop back uh, from these highs to 20,000 US dollars levels. Cool. Let's go and check out our next news. Crypto analyst Jason Pizzino says Bitcoin could explode by over 60% in coming months. But there is a catch. So there is always a catch. Uh, Pizzino, uh, he has almost uh, 270, uh, 67 uh, Twitter followers. And let's quote, if we get about those levels consolidate and continue to move, higher with higher highs and higher lows the next key level is 48,000 and 22,000 US dollar levels but I think we are getting too far ahead of ourselves to even contemplate getting to the high 40,000 or even low 50,000 at this point as there is so much work to do for Bitcoin at, at these lower levels the 50 Fibonacci which just about that is 32,000 so far, a round number about 32,800. That's our first level, 32,800, the Fibonacci 50. The next level is most crucial, 49, uh, 40, uh, 34,500. That's uh, our major uh, Fibonacci retracement level from all time high of uh, 69,000 US to zero. So far, we have 32,800, but we have so many Fibonacci levels it's depending on from where do you uh, pulling out pulling up so okay so a lot of numbers but guys uh, there is uh, just these are our levels so 38,000 should be the price where subsequently search higher after consolidating about the 38,000 US dollar price if we can overcome all of these resistance levels sooner rather than later then we start to climb back about those levels to consolidate about the 48,000 level and work our for higher high so let's make this happen i like more this uh, <clears throat> probability but we'll see binance launches massive 500 million us dollar investment fund to boost crypto and blockchain adoption so binance is a is a big big player with incubation binance labs aims to con uh, connect projects with binance network of resources experts and mentors to help them drive successful product development and growth binance labs run its incubation program regularly and is currently supporting its fourth cohort early stage venture investment includes token and equity investments across all sectors of cryptocurrency and web free including infrastructure DeFi. NFT, gaming, metaverse, social and crypto adoption platforms. I like all of these. Lead state growth investment targets more mature companies looking to scale or bridge into the web free ecosystem with the Binance ecosystem as a solid strategic partner. Stated by Changzheng Cao CZ. In a web free environment, the connection between values, people and economies is essential. And if these three element elements come together to build an ecosystem that will accelerate the mass adoption of the blockchain technology and crypto. The goal of the newly closed investment fund is to discover and support projects and funders with the potential to build and to lead Web3 across DeFi, NFTs, gaming, metaverse, social and more. So projects uh binance invested also in x infinity sandbox polygon and step in so i like all of them next piece of news is quite interesting news that is why ada is pumped yesterday and the previous day ada over 5 million native assets have been minted on cardano good news if you are holding cardano over 5 million so i don't understand 5 million tokens what there are no, no there aren't 5 million projects and if uh, one project maybe has hundreds of millions of tokens so i don't understand maybe with nfts projects and nfts all together but this is not an accurate number just 5 million tokens so guys what are you talking about so policies uh, 54,000 uh, uh, 54, policies 
5 million load I don't know what's this 80 98 percent one hour one age one hour load yeah five minute load 28 uh, one hour load 20 uh, not 28 90 98 93 and 72 the 24 hour load so I don't understand these tokens but uh, yeah right out of the box with us the use of smart contracts and they will launch uh, a kind of new smart contract and they will migrate uh, and, and this is how uh, I think there will be uh, these events that they will announce uh, in on the consensus uh, conference next week Cardano blockchain has grown by little over 70,000 over the last 30 days uh, with well over 2,000 wallets being added per day over said period period okay so guys I don't I, I don't understand these 5 million native assets but uh, sounds good and hope Cardano will go forward crazy news dental design studio to buy land in the metaverse for a virtual practice metaverse okay so quite interesting these uh, metaverse studio bought the land and they want to they want uh, they want <laughs> clients also onboarding in metaverse and uh, 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 educating them dental practices and giving patients to chance and experience to dentists differently uh, so this is uh, i think this is just for some marketing uh, purpose but uh, sounds ridiculous but yesterday that was the news that fidelity investments is hiring more than 200 people and building up the custody and trading service for ethereum so this is a huge news and don't forget that fidelity um, started to uh, uh, providing investors the option allocating up to 20 percent of their retirement plans into bitcoin and also that was the news that south korea sets 117 million us dollar in the metaverse investment and this is the south korean government so guys that's huge news let's go and check my twitter feed uh, yeah so inflation is causing the most headache recently also the US Treasurer hasn't seen what comes with insane money printing uh, so check it out and yeah I think I was wrong then about um, the path that inflation um, would take as I mentioned there have been unanticipated and large shocks to the economy that have boosted uh, energy and food prices and um, supply bottlenecks that have affected our economy badly that I didn't at the time didn't fully understand I think I was wrong yeah then so she was wrong but before we forget we forgive to her so breaking Chipotle is now accepting Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies as payment methods so this is huge crypto adoption Chipotle Mexican Grill let's go to Chipotle and spend your not Bitcoin but maybe your stable coins <laughs> next piece of news is spot Bitcoin ETF in Canada is so popular added 13,000 BTC in six weeks so what is this if not accumulation and if I'm just checking this the Bitcoin purpose ETF is holding more than 20,000 uh, 20,000 BTC 20,000 BTC it's about maybe 3.5 billion US dollars of Bitcoin and congratulations to Canada like and share like and share guys okay Bitcoin that haven't moved one plus year is at all-time high all-time high with 65 percent of the circulating supply so more than 65 percent of the circulating supply uh, haven't moved uh, plus one year and this supply is at whales and long-term hodlers so Bitcoin yearly lows for six, uh, 65 200 180 uh, uh, 185 and now the recent low is 27,700 and today we are around 30,000 Education and Crypto World Star uh, got this response from Laser Pangats. Genesis NFT is coming 
stay tuned and wait for the whitelisting guys smash these and push and retweet check out lizard pangat's video on tiktok uh, also you can follow us on tiktok uh, and let's see what's going on here cool okay yes yes guys cool so guys definitely uh, visit our farms if you are holding uh, ASC20 of Corenex then go to Uniswap if you are holding Binance Match version of Corenex go to PancakeSwap provide some liquidity and uh, come and look up for juicy 330% APRs and also if you are staking more then you will get a higher chance to be on the whitelist of the Genesis Laser Pangats. Guys, let's go and check out our farms. Let's see what's happening on uh, the charts. Uh, we see Ethereum is just consolidating uh, after the yesterday drop. Uh, on the daily chart, we are in Ethereum based on this uh, support that also bounced uh, last year June and July so bounced perfectly here and now side uh, ranging in this between resistance and support so so the resistance is 2000 US dollar the support is 170 uh, seven, one, uh, 1700 is the resistance so cool but let's make a higher low here and then let's go for a higher high let's go and check out uh, bitcoin bitcoin on the daily yes resistance just uh, failed, failed and now this 28300 just uh, bounced bitcoin there so i think there is a nice bounce because also Bitcoin broke our uh, upper resist uh, upper trend line and bounced perfectly here and now going up. So maybe uh, during the weekend we will going back into this resistance zone. So I'm pulling it out. So I would watch this and if Bitcoin can break thirty one thousand US dollar, this is my major next resistance. And let's see what's happening in this resistance box. If it fails, then uh, we will go back to 28,300 and also it can draw further to 27,000 uh, 27, US dollars. What about Bitcoin longs? Bitcoin longs, uh, yeah, so this is not a Bitcoin longs, but this is a Bitcoin longs. Bitcoin longs increasing, yes, looks good. Wow, what an increase of Bitcoin longs. And Bitcoin shorts increasing as well, but not as as big as previous time. Bitcoin dominance is just side waving, uh, and this is a kind of rising wedge. And rising wedge is a bearish pattern, so hope it will break down. So guys, smash those like, push the bell notification, or subscribe to the channel. Also write in the comment section which is your favorite altcoin from the top 50. We will look into it and let's go visit our farms uh, follow us uh, on twitter also uh, follow uh, Korean platform and definitely follow the laser punk gods and uh, yeah so see you tomorrow enjoy your day bye bye